Hello everyone and welcome back to another Universe Sandbox 2 video and today we're doing another episode of checking out your guys' solar system. So today we've got one that I've been meaning to do for quite a while because it has been in my list of um, solar system saves to do. So it has been um, in my folder quite a while and I've been uh, meaning to do it. So apologies for the long wait but here it is finally. So today we are checking out the uh, the subsystems. It's called the subsystem and it's by the user Universe Sandbox 2 channel IP. So yeah, we're going to be checking out the system they made today. So massive thanks to them for sending it in. So yeah, there we go. So before, before we start, obviously a massive thanks to everyone who has subscribed as normal. And if you haven't already, subscribe if you're new. Helps on the journey to 3,000 subscribers before next month. Because that would be awesome. But anyways, let's get into this. So the subsystem. Let's see what we have here. So here we go. All right. Ooh, okay, there's some cool looking things in here. There's a planet called me. There's one called Neptunia guy. Okay, so yeah, I'm guessing that that's pretty close to me. So oh okay, I'm liking the background. Alright, so let's um, go ahead and see what we got here. So let's go to view and then try all oh, this. Oh, okay. So nice small system for us to check out today. Alright, so Alright, so the main star, let's go ahead and begin with you. So massive one sun. I think that pretty much is the same radius as the sun, as you can see there. So very, very similar, if it is different. Yeah, actually, this must be the sun. It's got the same radius, or same rate, or same radius, I think. Same temperature, same luminosity. See, this was the sun originally. All right, so next up, we got the blood moon. Oh, that's a modded object. Oh, now that is cool. That is cool. Look at that. That is a blood moon. Okay, we'll go ahead and save that. So let's just call it blood moon 2. So I think I already had one, but this will replace it. So I'm going to save that because, yeah, some people actually requested that. So, yeah, we'll use that in um, as a custom object for now so now we have a blood moon pretty cool same as the normal moon in radius and all that so there's that all right next up we've got Nitan ninatian so there we go so we've got this object here it's gone um realistic mode so yeah there we go quite a simple earth-like object very similar or same ray or same mass it's very similar radius relatively similar temperature doesn't reflect any light at all and very similar structure to Earth as well. So there's its life likelihood, 53%. Very close to Earth similarity as well. So there is that. Okay, let's see what we got next. Next up, we've got um, the planet called Live. Or Live, however you want to say it. So actually, it's just a little minor object, as you can see here. So 20 kilometers in radius, 1.23 AU away from the star. There's its uh, materials there. Uh, temperature, it's very cold here. So yeah, there is that. All right, let's see what we got next. All right, so next we've got Amen. So it's a gas giant here. Okay, cool. So we've got Amen. So gas giant, a little larger than Uranus is. So let's get a quick comparison there. So there's Uranus, a little larger. Um, very cold here as well, reflects a lot of light. And then there's its structure, so mostly a gas giant. So there is that. Yeah, more of a gas giant than an ice giant. Okay, next, see what we have next. Okay, so we've got Endonia. Oh, I re wow, I really like the colours of this. Well, wow, that red is really bright. Is that a modded red by any chance? Yeah, that that is definitely modded red. If I just get my regular red here, my normal red, um, right, pause, pause simulation, then we'll, yeah, that is a definitely a different shade of red to this one. If we just do that, yeah, this is a this is a um, deeper sort of red. So very very cool. I'll actually um, save that so we can um, use that as a template from that one as well. So. Yeah, we have we now we have a new red template, which should be quite cool. So, yeah, look at that. That red is really really cool. I do like that shade of red, and it goes really well with the purple. I've got to say, that was a very nice job with this object here. So it's also um, just below um, zero degrees at minus ten. It reflects a lot of light. Um, similar structure to Earth again. And yeah, there you go. So there's Endonia. Okay, let's see what we have next. Okay, next up we've got Neptune here, guys. So, oh, it's Neptune! Yay! And it's got an object orbiting it. Whoa. Okay. Right, so yeah, we got um, two objects here, and yeah, these are modded objects, as you can see, so that's quite cool. Yeah, so Neptune, guy. Okay. All right, so we got the Cassini spacecraft, not Cassini, the Cassini spacecraft there. That's quite cool. So yeah, there's um, a good look at that there. All right, then we've got Battle, but yeah, Battlefield. So there's that. So a mixture of green, blue, and or green, blue, and like a lime green as well. Very small in radius. Relative, very cold as well. A lot of iron in it, as you can see there for the blue atmosphere. That's very nice. Then we've got one called Universe, which is a gas giant, a very green gas giant as well. So there is that, looking very cool. Yeah, but there's that as well. So there's the Neptunia system there. So that's everything with that, as you can see there. Okay, there we go. Okay, let's see what we got next. And then the last, oh, and then we've got a few more actually. 
the fragment over here as well. Whoa, okay, we've got a ring system. Okay, very cool. So we've got Satiter, Satiter, I'm really sorry, I can't pronounce that one. So we've got this one here, like that. So there we go, it's got some fragments orbs in it. It's got um, a little world called Eva. It's a lot of fragments as well. Fragments are always um, the same, pretty much. So we don't need to go and check those guys out. But there's this little Eva here, there's this little structure and composition there. There's another fragment there. And there's another fragment here. So this is a lot of fragments orbs in it. So there is that. So there we go. Nice blue. I really like the blue and red ring system around it. I think that's quite a nice touch as well. So there is that. So this gas giant is also, let's check the size, pretty much very similar to Jupiter in size there. A little bigger. Then next up we've got Red Nova, which I think is the last object with a very, very strange orbit. So here we go. Here is Red Nova. So it's got a blue atmosphere, red surface, very nice. 44 AU away, so this is very far away. It's got 79 ATM atmosphere, so similar to Venus's atmosphere there with the um, ATM. Um, it's relatively hot here, so it would make a quite a good um, tourist destination for like warm weather. It's really quite a, got a nice um, spot to have a holiday on, even though it's quite far from the star. But either way, that's um, a nice place to be if for a nice warm temperature. But I'm guessing when it gets to the other side of the star, that's where it gets really cold. And then we've got Red Nova B, which is a tiny little Pluto. Hey, it's Pluto. So a very, very small little Pluto there, as you can see there. So let's get a look of it. So yeah, there is this tiny little Pluto. So yeah. Alright, so let's actually just play this since this is quite a little quick, quite a quick simulation to get through. Let's actually speed it up a bit. So let's see how fast this will play. Let's have a look. Let's keep going. How fast does the simulation go? Uh, go. Let's see here. Alright. Okay, that's the fastest the simulation is going to go, it looks like. So, yeah, there you go. So, yeah, what do you guys think of this system? Let us know down in the comments. I'm pretty sure um, the curator, Universe Sandbox 2 Channel IP, he'll be interested to see what you've got to say about this. So. Yeah, there we go. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this quick video today because I don't really upload on Friday. So this is extra. So if you haven't noticed, I've actually uploaded every day this week so far. So yeah, I'll keep that up for Saturday and Sunday as well. So it's a whole week of videos um, as a little booster, I guess. So yeah, as I said, I, have, um, I was slacking a few weeks previously. So yeah, I thought I'd boost, um, boost the video production up a bit. So yeah, I hope you've been enjoying the um, videos, um, daily videos for this week. It'll probably resume a little slower um, after the weekend. But yeah, hopefully you enjoyed this week nonetheless, even though we've still got a few more days to go. So yeah, that is that. But yeah, um, hopefully you enjoyed this video. So make sure we did hit that like button, subscribe for more. And we're going to make this system go boom. Boom. So we've got a nice red pink supernova there and it's going to roast the system up. So yeah, there we go, I guess. So um, yeah, like I said, hopefully you all enjoyed this video. Make sure if you haven't already, subscribe if you're new. Helps on journey to 3,000 subscribers. Oh, and another supernova. What the heck? Or did the simulation just speed up? We've got massive rings here. Look at that. All the rings have exploded out. Hey, a little spacecraft survived. Still going there. And all the largest objects as well. Actually, before we end, though, let's quickly just get a quick comparison. We didn't do that. Um, so let's quickly um, go here. And there you go. So here's a comparison. So we've got, obviously, the sun-like star. Then we've got our Jupiter counterpart. Then we've got, I guess this is, yeah, the, the object a little larger than Uranus. We've also got our Neptune planet. Then we've got the planet with a really nice red atmosphere. This has definitely got my favourite planet in the whole system. I have to say. So yeah, this one here. Definitely a thumbs up from me. Um, then we've got um, this one here. Quite hard to pronounce. Then we've got the Universe Green modded object here. We've got Red Nova, which is cool. Then we've got the Red Blood Moon. That's really cool. That's, that's definitely my second favourite. And then we've got um, the smaller objects here, the minor objects. And yeah, there you go. So there's the whole system. And then you've got the little spacecraft at the very bottom here. So yeah, there is that. So... Yeah, like I said, like, um, though, make sure you subscribe for new and all that. And, yeah, make sure you guys all have a great day. Um, yeah, tell me what you thought of the system down below. And, yeah, so I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye and kaboom. Uh, yeah, see you guys around.